Hi guys and welcome to a new video. In this video I will show you how I went from a level 88 noob to a level 125 pro in just two days. First I show you the preparations, then I show you actually doing it and then I show you what happened after. So be sure to watch the entire video. Right now I'm going to buy ghost jars. This guy sells 30,000 ghost jars. He has 28,000 dropped and also 2,000 in the vending machine. Let's buy the world. I will need 56,000 ghost jars. This will only cost me like 70 diamond locks because I get a lot of ghost jar seeds back from using the ghost jars. As you can see I'm currently only at level 88. I will be at max level which is level 125 and it will only cost me around 70 diamond locks like I said. So in this video I will show you how I do it. Now let's buy this world. He sells them for 200 per 74. This world has 10,400 ghost jars. That will be 38 diamond locks and 48 world locks. Okay, let's put a sign so I don't forget. So there's 10.4k here, 30k here. So I got a total of 40.4k now and as I said I need 56k so that means I still need 15.6k more. I found another seller. They have 4000. They also apparently want 5 word locks for vend and 1 word lock for the word lock in the world. So 14 diamond locks and 86 word locks. So we got 4k more. That's really nice. I found a world that sells 6200. The price is 22 diamond locks and 94 world locks. So it's the same price as all the other ones. 200 for 74. Let's do it. 3, 2, 1, go. Alright, so 6.2k here. That means we only need 5400 more. Not much left. Nice, these are some cheap ones I just found. I found a seller, but these motherfucker put them inside of rocks. Why? Why did you do that, man? Okay, he has 2.6k and he sells it for cheaper than the others. Only 72 word blocks per 200 ghost charge. Maybe it's cheaper because it's harder to get because it's dropped inside of rocks and not inside of dirt. I'm just joking. That's not the reason. I need only 2.7k more. Okay, I found a guy who sells 2.2k. He dropped it inside obsidian. Why don't you just use dirt, man? Well, obsidian is not as bad as using rocks. What's next? Using steel blocks? Okay, he had 90 more. Nice, I just counted that I only need 200 more here. Nice, I will also get the last jars from this guy as well. I'm finally done buying them all. I got 56k now. 30k here, 10.4k, 4k, 6.2k, 2.6k, 2.477k and 323 dropped right here. In total that's 56k. Now let me go and look at my trade history and count how much I paid for these. I paid a bit over 2 BGLs for all the chars. But the thing is when you use the chars you will get ghost char seeds back. And with that let me count how much I will actually get back from these two BGLs. So I just counted that I will get back 1.2911 BGLs which means I will only lose 77 diamond locks. So it's not as expensive as it seems at first. You can't land the ghost jar seeds and sell those ghost jars. So I need to get 21 of these but I'm just going to get 22 just in case. These items are used in the XP method. When you catch ghosts this item makes it so that you get 50 more XP for every ghost you catch so it's always used in this method it's called coconut tart for the same reason i'm also going to buy these 
because when you use a gingerbread cookie you have a 10% chance to get triple XP for the next 30 minutes and that stacks with the coconut tart. I can't find any cheaper than this anymore so I'm just going to buy the last 8 for this price. It's not too big of a loss. Now I got 22 of both. That's really nice. The last thing I need is the ghost dragon charm which I just found for a pretty good price so let's buy it. I actually still need 200 ghosts in a charge. Luckily I have those in my storage right here. So I think that's everything. I think I know how all I need. I got all of the ghost charge, the food items I need, the dragon charm and I got the ghost in a charge. So all I need now is 10.5 hours because that's how long it's going to take. We will first move ghost charge to this world and then we will start. Okay, so we managed to move 12,000 ghost charms here, so now we will start using it. So I'm using the ghost dragon charm, the coconut tart and the gingerbread cookie. He is placing ghosts using ghost in a charge and I'm catching them immediately with ghost charms. This combination gives a lot of XP really fast. Okay nice, we did it for half an hour but I already got to level 90 so a bit of progress. I'm going to now try to do this method with my phone and my PC so I will place the ghost on my phone and then catch the ghosts on my PC. Let's see how that goes. It did work quite well, I'm at level 92. I'm close to level 94 now. I then streamed for 14 hours in total. First I streamed for 5 hours just sitting on one place and putting down the ghost charge. Then I streamed for another 9 hours the next day. Both streams can be found on my channel on the live tab. Here's the end of the second stream where I finally got to max level. As you will see my voice is a bit tired from speaking for 9 hours straight. Here is the last dirt. Special thank you to Unknown Farmer for helping me like 7 hours or maybe even 8 hours. The stream has been going on for 9 hours and 10 minutes. 3, 2, 1, go. Let's go guys! Level 125, finally! Thank you so much for everyone who was a part of it. I got around 13,000 seeds, so I need 5 full platform farms. Let's buy those right now. He said 17, but now he wants 18. Whatever. I decided to buy dirt farms because why not? This guy had another one as well. Found one again. And he has another one. Nice. This is the fifth world I just bought. And this will be the last one I need. No, I can start planting the trees. I need to buy a mag plant to make the planting easier. I had no idea that mag plants are this expensive now. 163 diamond blocks. I then had a whole stream where I just planted all the seeds I got. The trees were done, it was time to buy some fuel. I found some for 15 per world luck and I bought around 1200. I then did another stream where I harvested all the trees using Dreamcatcher stuff, Harvester of Sorrow and Fuel Packs. I then sold the 1100 seeds I got for 1 per world luck. I then found a buyer for all my ghost jars. I got more diamond locks back that I was expecting. So in the end I only lost like 60 diamond locks. Well that was everything. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.